Tuesday morning, the dancers arrive from across Europe into sunny Glasgow. Denmark, Denmark has, has arrived in Glasgow, Glasgow and, and we're feeling so excited. excited. We brought from Ukraine positive emotions and love and peace and very good time. First up, it's time to meet the press. I represent Portugal many times, but singing, not dancing, you know, it's very different. Wow, 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 wow. The hard work begins with group rehearsal. It's a nice kind of atmosphere. It's a matter on the dance floor, but you better not kill the groove. Hey, hey, hey. But the Netherlands appear to have someone missing. I'm here on my own. My partner Thomas is singing a concert in the Netherlands. And um, I hope he gets here soon because I'm really lonely. Portugal have their own drama. What you've done is you've pulled what are called intercostal muscles, and that's what's giving you the pain. My rib is in pain, but uh, the show must go on, and I just want to make Portugal proud. The dancers are taking any spare moment to enjoy the sights of Glasgow. So we're here by the tall ships down by the Clyde, and it's absolutely gorgeous down here. Thomas has finally arrived from the Netherlands, but something is still missing. Well, I just arrived here in Glasgow. I got no luggage. They left it in Holland. But Mumiana is in a hotel and I'm very late, so bye-bye, see you later. As the show draws nearer, the pressure builds. We've just been rehearsing all day, getting ready, preparing, getting quite excited. There's some serious fake tanning going on right now. Hi. Thomas is here, the suitcase is here, so let's get on with dancing. Woohoo! We can hear the audience now, so it's, it's crazy. So nervous. <laughs> We've had fake tans, sequins, tears and laughter, but hey, that's Eurovision. 